A very good morning to everyone. I'm Dr. Arjun Dang from Dr. Dang's lab. So this short video is to talk about the novel coronavirus. And uh, it was extremely unfortunate that 2020, the new year, started with a very sad news about this new coronavirus that has started in the city of Wuhan in China. And um, very similar to the earlier epidemic outbreak of SARS, uh, this coronavirus has uh, now uh, been reported to have close to 15,000 infected cases and the death, the death toll has reached close to 1,500 with primarily the cases being concentrated in Wuhan and in China and in multiple travelers who've been to China and now are in countries outside China as well. More concentrated in Southeast Asia. A lot of reports have also been coming that there are multiple coronavirus cases that have been recorded in South Korea as well. <clears throat> With all this information, uh, people might have gotten extremely overwhelmed. Some of them would have panicked also. But this short video is uh, to explain to you how to actually act in these times and what is the best precautions that you can take for yourself and for your family. So uh, just to tell you a little bit about the virus, this is like a common cold the way a common cold would spread so sneezing coughing shaking hands with someone who's already been infected so it's basically droplet infection so what can we do to prevent such things is obviously respiratory etiquette like we call it that you should always cough inside a handkerchief with your elbow folded should to maintain hand hygiene to use hand sanitizers uh, to clean your hands very often or to use uh, liquid soap to wash your hands as often as possible. Secondly, obviously, uh, this coronavirus has been known to originate from a fresh seafood market in Wuhan. So there are certain guidelines by the WHO and the CDC that also tell us that avoid eating un uncooked or raw uh, meat or seafood. So I feel in these times, these steps are definitely necessary for us to uh, combat the issue of coronavirus. India up till now has reported three cases, three confirmed cases down south in uh, Kochi. And until now, there are no other cases that have been reported in, in the rest of the country. Uh, the things that we must keep in mind is that anyone in the family who or your known friend who has visited China and uh, has any symptoms of the flu, such as a running, uh, running nose, cold, cough, fever, body ache, etc., they should immediately see their physician. In the meantime, um, be extra careful while you travel in airplanes, especially try and use an N95 mask because uh, flights and airports are places that have a high density of people who are traveling and uh, there's a higher chance of you getting the virus as well. But apart from these guidelines, you will read a lot of things online in various websites, vlogs, etc. But this is the time when all of us need to come together, not panic and make use of all the relevant information to create awareness among our family and friends. Thank you so much.